see the glow of the bones in your faces. <laughs> so good. So good. But we've done it. We're here at the general election of a lifetime. opportunity to let America know what you're all about and what platforms you support. Let's start with you, May. Hello, America. As you heard before, my woman number one priority is protecting us, right, from threats that are hidden and visible. And nuclear threats, yes, they were something we think of in the past, but they can easily crop up and they will crop up now. But along with protecting ourselves, I'm also interested in giving y'all some skills. <laughs> Just like when I had my imaginary date with Eric, right? I know how to have fun. <laughs> and I want you all to taste the rainbow. <laughs> you know what my platform will be? Exercising ghosts from all haunted house and people. <laughs> I hadn't mentioned this yet, but zombies are the next phase. Of <laughs> the young lady over here mentioned that as well. So yes, ghosts that are still around and haunting us, we will exercise them. My next platform, destroy all traffic lights. <laughs> because it would be an exercise for when they really go out. When the nuclear bomb comes down, you should be able to stop, yield, or speed right on through. And then my last platform, take all the guns and melt them down. That's right, guys. Because in fact, guns are the reason why we got to this nuclear mess. All right? It was just a step climb, a step climb. We need to know how to use knives. Uh, she gives, uh, uh, whatever it takes, props, all of that, too, she just nailed down, you know, all that. You know, that's the kind of stuff that we need to prepare for and be ready for. Vote even May. Yeah. <laughs> 
baby. I am going to regulate synchronized swimming. <laughs> Social media election. Uh, if you are feeling right now, if you're feeling Eva May, can I get a beep, 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 beep? Beep, 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 which you're going to do by text at the end of this campaign. Right now, the finest minds of behind Bumble, Who Wants to Be a Millionaire, and Pop-Tarts have united to create the voter user experience before you. So if you can get out your game grades that you got with your platform, or with your uh, program, they're going to have our games. You got them? Okay, so the candidates and their teams will use their wits and all their money they raised earlier during the general election to play the game. You in the audience will determine which square we play by shouting out the name of the game you want. Starting right now. Service. Are we ready for not so secret service? We're going to get a, a little bit of a, an idea about what happens uh, when their security detail is away and free to do what they please. <laughs> Better halves. All right, let's see. 
Let's say, uh, who y'all better have some kids? Is that you, John? Yeah, it is, was it? But you got one? All right. No, that's okay. He just said it. So I did it. What's a, uh, what's a charity that you support? Uh, UNICEF. UNICEF. Perfect. Uh, for better hats, uh, coincidentally, both candidates' significant others show up at the same UNICEF fundraiser. Uh, See it, James. <laughs> for an hour, raise some cash. Who are your friends here, huh? Uh, we're all trying we're all, to be black. We're all being <laughs> black. <laughs> <laughs> we're kind of hoping that she'd be swinging by. We we're all kind of hoping yeah. to see her. Uh, the candidates are off doing their own thing today. It's just us fellas, oh, right? Shucks. You know, it's a funny story. I actually flew a bomber in World War II. <laughs> Is that correct? <laughs> oh, 
Yeah. Yeah. Let me ask you a question. Have you ever sent a pickup line out to someone and they didn't respond to you? <laughs> What's like a great line that you use that you couldn't get a response to? Well, there's this one I use that say, hey, angle face, and then I quickly say, I mean, meant, hey, angel face. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
your name, sir? I'm Ted. Ted? Ted. Is it, I'm Ted. 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 <laughs> and your question. I, I'm wondering what the candidate's stance on nuclear disarmament is. I don't think we even touched on that tonight. We could go ahead and did not see that coming, candidates. <laughs> Uh, we take their nuclear weapons away. We store them. Uh, and then if they try to build some more, we steal those. And then we have a, a, a bunker full of stuff ready to go. So yes, sir, I'm really in poor of nuclear disarmament. <laughs>
endorsing Skittles, what's your choice? Are you Taco Team? Do I think you don't eat Harmony? <laughs> I am Taco Team, yeah. <laughs> No, there's something about you. You're like literally 50 years older than me. But no. just, oh. There's something right. I got the impact. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's hear it. What game do you want to see, people? <laughs> We have some crucial special interest groups here with us this evening. Let's see if the candidates are ready to endorse. Special interest, if you could stand up for me. Right. Oh, did you work? I don't know. Which one are you? Do you have your designated? Do you have your... Uh... Oh. Oh. Picked out. What else? Is that... We have one? All right. We have one. Walmart. Walmart. All right. Each candidate is going to come and see you. There they are. Here's my candidates. Yeah. Come on, let's see if you can get this, the interest of the Walmart Coalition. No. You know Walmart? <laughs> Down in Georgia, we love our Walmarts. <laughs> All right? We know that we can get anything we want in there. All right? And everything that you have in Walmart is what people need to make their survival kit. All right? You got the water, you got the food, you got the lighters. Right, you got coloring books for the kids, Skittles to make you think of rainbows, right? And you've got guns, right? If they're still around, we're still gonna use them. So I just wanna say that we support you. We know that you're gonna support us, and hopefully some of your stores are still alive and well when the apocalypse comes and when the bombs come, because we're gonna need Walmart in our corner. Thank you. Hey, Walmart, um, you know, my city's a burner. He goes to Burning Man, and I know that he, <laughs> He loves it. He buys everything there. And geez, you take care of him for a whole week and there's just nothing else he could have. So you've been taking care of my boy and I appreciate it. But that's my boy. Um, I don't have an orange for you, but I'd give you one if I did have one. I bet you got I bet you got it. That's a tough choice, Walmart. What's your name? Kathleen. Kathleen. Kathleen, what's your choice? Even May, all the way. Even May. Come on, get your, get your blue, Even May. Go ahead and go ahead and give her your. I'll take your necklace. Yes. <laughs> well, well, that was a neat transaction. <laughs> the uh, Eva May campaign just had a special announcement for the next snowflake. Uh, sir, you should come on down. Yeah. That's where you're going. Because you not, might not be special to Crash, but you're special to us, right, Eva? That's right. That's right. Good point. Good point. We got what's your name? Uh, I'm Marcus from Big Pharma. Marcus from Big Pharma. Candidates? Marcus, I wouldn't be able to get out of bed without you. Thank you so much. You're fueling my campaign in ways you don't even know. And God bless you. And if I, when I do it as a White House, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to build something called Viagra Falls. It's going to be water. Thank you so much, Marcus. Keep up the good work. You got me. Thank you for what you do, okay? First of all, when the nuclear bomb will come, we're gonna need Big Farmer right there in our corner to zap us back in life, to use us for medicine, okay? Right? When we're trying to have these babies, whether you want them or not, if you, if you want them or not, we're gonna need to zap women with something that can help that birth come out. <laughs> these things I'm all thinking about for Big Farmer, medicine, and we need you right there doing your R&D, and giving us what we need in order to bring on the next generation of Americans and human beings. <laughs> awesome, awesome. Thank you very much. A good choice, Marcus. Well, I think Eva May has given us the best choice to really just sell Big Pharma to the entire country. We love you. That's all right. Yeah, yeah. Eva May? Yeah. 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 Thank you, Candace. Uh, we're going to need another game.
Snack International. Yes. Can you tell us about your, your big lobby thing? Uh, we're really endorsing for um, sugary foods to make a comeback into uh, America's stomachs. <laughs> <laughs> All right, candidates. This your bowl of skills. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, so hey, so yes. <laughs> 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 oh, jeez. Okay. Now, honey, you don't. What's your name? Nina. Nina's a beautiful name. Um, you don't want to be seen as being too loyal to Mars. So these Werthers I have, some of them have been, she's got my purse, some of them have been in there a while, so they're not fresh. They, they are made by Mars. And I know that you've got so many delicious sugary snacks. And, 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 and my, my Cheryl, uh, my daughter-in-law, I don't like her, but I do like my grandkids. And I give them every kind of snack under the rainbow, even, 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 even my rainbow. And uh, I, I just really, I just love snacks, and I love you, and I haven't gotten a, a lanyard yet, so I... <laughs> Gladys on 
Tinder. And I said, are you wearing Windex pants? Because I could see myself in them. And she didn't even reply to that. Evil recipe for Holocaust brownies are delicious! Eva May is dating strange people she meets on the street! Gladys Granger had sex with Mitch McConnell! That's disgusting! There with that message. Thank you. Who's got a game? Let me yeah. their decision making as president. Ms. Washington, for I know you love our weekly survivor, you know, fix them up homes. We got a great person for you, fellow candidate, Steve Solka. Sackle. 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 I'm sorry. He's going to teach us how to pee and drink. Okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what I've got here is actually a five gallon bucket. Oh, you're in. <laughs> <laughs> Can I ask you who it is? I'm sorry. <laughs> what I do is, uh, what I do is, um, I put out an ad on Craigslist. And I, <laughs> <laughs> I usually think you have to pay a lot of money for it, but actually, there's a lot of people who will pee for free. That's <laughs> true. <laughs> <laughs> so, I was thinking more of my, my own pee, but I'm open. This is, a, this is all about practice, okay? It's you're all about making sure that... You now, all we're going to do is we're just going to pour the urine through the funnel. Okay. It's just going to go through, and it's going to be purified enough.
everybody else's nuclear weapons <coughs> now, or will you have to build them? First, they started already, but I know my first day one, first 100 days, I'm building bigger and bigger so that we can take the world's nuclear <laughs> into our bunker. So thank you for bringing that up. <laughs>
excuse me, they should be behind us. <laughs>
Uh, again, thanks for coming. We're going to announce the winner in the lobby. So take your time, get your coats, go out, and then we're going to have an announcement in the lobby as you're coming out. Not just yet, we still got to count. But we'll see you in the lobby and we'll, get you, we'll tell you who your next president is. <laughs>